Now, moving forward, you're going to want to make sure you clean up and get rid of any issues that may be causing your AutoCAD drawing in particular to crash. If it's a system-wide issue, like regardless of which drawing you're working on, then you may need to look into a reinstall or perhaps checking into the graphics drivers of your PC. But if it's drawing specific, you're going to want to do some uh, necessary steps to clean the file and prevent that in the future. Before we go to that though, uh, if you haven't already, don't forget to check out my AutoCAD Fundamentals and Workflows course. In it, I teach you all about templates as well as file types, adding and creating textiles, annotative text, layers, layouts, viewports, XREFs, site plans, plotting, PDFs, and everything in between. It's a great course for upping your AutoCAD skills in a short amount of time. Everything is quick and to the point and comes from my 20 plus years of experience using AutoCAD. You can get it at the link up above and down below at a discount for viewers such as yourself. Now, moving along, uh, I mentioned earlier that you're going to want to make some preventative setting changes in case this happens to you in the future as well. And that specifically is setting up your save file or auto save settings within AutoCAD. To do that, you can simply type in options and hit enter. And then under the open and save tab here, you can go down to this left side here. Automatic save should be default checked on, but if it's not, make sure you check it on. You can also set the interval between the default saves. I've got mine at 15 for this install. Typically I'll be between somewhere from 10 minutes to 20 or 30 minute saves. It just depends on the type of work you're doing and if you're willing to risk the longer intervals of losing data for say a speed improvement. When I'm working on large or bigger projects, the freezing or saving uh, every 10 to 15 minutes can get a little bit annoying. So sometimes I'll bump that up depending on the project and my risk 